Hello everybody, it's Mirialda here once again, and welcome back to an unboxing of a free figure. Yes, so, um, if you watched the initial unboxing haul video or whatever, you know the story, but this is Yukinoshita Yukino, the China dress version. She is from Yohari Ore no Seishun Love Comedy wa Machigateru Zoku, or Oregaru. She is a prize figure, she's part of the Corful series by Taito. Uh, Yukino released on June 18th of 2021. I ordered her on September 2nd of 2022 from Ukiyo Kumo as part of their Labor Day sale where you could get a free figure with an order of, I think, over $100. She is my free figure. Um, ordered her on the 2nd of September. She shipped out on the 13th. And she got here today on the 19th of September. Free shipping also. So yay. Uh, this figure, I've kind of been interested in it because I think it looks, at least to me, it looked good. Uh, it is still a prize figure, of course. So we will temper our expect expectations. But like I said, I've kind of been interested in it, but I never really would have bought it if it wasn't for the sale. I mean, you can't pass up a free figure. And she's in a China dress, so yay. Uh, Yukino is good, but she is not best girl. In my opinion, Yuigahama Yui is best girl. But Yukino, like I said, is good. So that was the spin around. There's the top of the box and the bottom. And I will say, typically when I get prize figures, which doesn't happen very often, I don't get a lot of them, but usually the box is pretty beat up. This one is in quite good, perfect condition. Uh, and Ukiyo Kumo, they definitely packed the shipping box very well. So, yeah, they're a U.S. store. Um, but shipping was good. Prices seemed okay. So, I may buy from them more in the future. We shall see. Let's get Yukino open. So, tape on the side. And then the main tape. Pop the pop it open and there is a blister inside we'll pull that out and inside the box just plain boring cardboard put that off to the side so the blister is pretty cheap plastic i mean it's a 20 dollar price figure i think 29 dollars would she would have cost me without the sale but she is is in a blister she's not just wrapped in a bag with in a cardboard box it is a half blister, so it's just holding her chest and knees in, like her, the bottom of her legs and her head is out in the open, but it's still wrapped in plastic. There is the side, and the back with the base, and the other side. So I have seen a few pictures on MFC of this figure, and yeah, she's a prize figure for sure. We'll see how this one turned out, but... There's like gaps and seams and scratches and stuff. But like I said, as a prize figure, you kind of expect that. And we have to temper our expectations. The base. So, yeah, the ones that I've seen have like squirrels and scratches. And I do see a little bit of that. It's nothing major though. Well, maybe, I mean, once you get out of the bright lights... But it is a smoky, translucent plastic base. It's got a little golden floral design. And two uh, hexagon peg holes for her pegs. It's, even though it is a little maybe scratchy, it's still better than some, at least it's not like a plain white disc like a lot of prize figures and scale, even scale figures have. Uh, let's go ahead and... Yep, it's got tape on the little half blister. Pop that open. Pull out Yukino. Now she's got decent weight to her. Uh, being a prize figure, she does not have a listed scale or anything. We'll set her down and clean up. But from should be probably around a one eighth scale figure. I had to guess. Uh, 
Okay, let's take a look at her. I'm going to try to tilt the camera down a little bit. So Yukino. Um, first glance, so far it looks okay. Um, her legs do have the uh, mold seam line down the top of them and the back of them, which is common with price figures. Um, the paint around, like the gold paint around her chest and neck and everything does seem to be done cleanly. A little bit of a slap there or light application and on the corner. Uh, there is a little streak on her arm. Could be from her hair. She's got nice uh, bows. Her hands pretty well detailed. And the hair is black, which fades to a translucent blast plastic tip. Um, looking at the gap between her legs, and so far so good. She is wearing white ones. A little bit of a gap up there, but overall, for a prize figure, not bad so far. Shoes, decent enough. I mean, there is the seam line, little little weak paint, but it's clean. Her dress is very textured, but it is just uh, colored plastic. It's not painted. And I'm sure like her flesh is not painted really. Um, her hair, obviously it's clear plastic, so it does have some paint on it. And same with her legs. Uh, you actually get some shading on the backs of her knees. So that's nice. And I like how like powerful her legs look like. She is a strong girl, it looks like. Uh, she is wearing her hair in little China, Chinese buns, which also have sculpting details. She's got a little hoge. I think her face looks pretty pretty good, close enough to Yukino for my taste. Um, this eye is maybe a little bit close, too close to the side of her head and not close enough to her nose. She does have painted teeth. Yukino is not an overly busty girl, but she does have some nice cleavage. A little bit of shine to her chest. Fingernails are painted. Um, there is an obvious join line in her hair there. And then I was going to point out another one that I saw, but I mean, again, temper our expectations. $29 figure, I think she was, and probably even cheaper originally. Pretty good. Let's go ahead and get her on the base. Pretty secure fit. Yeah, definitely a pretty secure fit. So that's good enough for now. Tilt up a little bit. And, yeah. Do a spin around of her like this. I think you you know for a cheap price figure turned out pretty good. I'm I am pleased with her. She was definitely worth the money I spent. <laughs> um, when I was putting her on the base, her leg does feel a little, little bendy, but I don't anticipate leaning. It is possible, depending on what they made her main support leg out of. But I'm not anticipating it. Uh, let's see, if I turn this a little bit, get some of the blinding light off of her. You can see her uh, colors a little bit better, I think. But yeah, like I said, uh, Yui is my best girl in Origaru, but Yukino is also a very nice girl. And this figure, I think mine is better than the ones I've seen on MFC, so there is that. Obviously still a prize figure, got some of the common prize figure flaws, but you know what you're, you should know what you're getting. So yay. Uh, this is Yukinoshita Yukino, the China dress version of her. She is from Yahari Ore no Seishun Love Comedy wa Machikateru Zoku, or Origairu. She is a prize figure, part of the Corful series by Taito. She originally released on June 18th of 2021. I paid nothing for her. She was a free free gift, kind of. 
or the bonus item. And yeah, turned out good. I'm happy to have her now. I hope you enjoyed. I'm out. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.